Alright, this is a tutorial for you noobs out there, like Alex, well, not Alex, not lately, but sometimes. But mainly Alex and Jesse, you guys sometimes mess up with the sync of your vids when you do compilations. And this is the way to do it. If, you, if you're going to be using footage with, you know, all sorts of different music and, you know, different BPMs and weird shit like that you have to mess with the speed a little bit and every time you do that you can't just trust the preview that you see in the program itself because what's gonna happen is when you actually render it it'll come out a lot differently than you know you imagined it's, it's really hard to predict and that's why you have to do test renders all the time so like you can test it here I mean you can already see like I tried to slow it down or speed it up tiny little bit maybe like you know fractions of seconds faster just to get the feet in sync and for each step you try to basically match it with the beat it, it's it sounds complicated but it isn't it's really simple but it's it's almost painstaking work because you have to do a lot of test renders and that's why it takes me two to three times as long to make these very simple videos you know I guess they're not that simple but whatever so if you look at this one it looks it looks kind of on point yeah it's pretty much on point but I mean you can't really be perfect unless you do math and no one wants to do math I just, I just do it by the feel but at the same time, you see how it looks good in the preview. You still have to make sure you do a test render. So I know some of you are using Vegas. So you go to do, 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 tools. Where the fuck is that? Preview and player. And then that bullshit comes up. Just press OK. It should do all that crap. And it's going to do a test render of that specific part. How it's going to look when you finally produce it. So. You need to do that to make sure it's actually on point. <sighs> Let's wait for this. It's running pretty fast because, you know, I've got like computer. All right, not really, but all right, there it's automatically playing. It looks okay, but for even crazier accuracy, right? This is what I do. Sometimes when it's hard to tell, you just slow it down a little bit and you actually look at it in slow motion and see if the beats match isn't isn't that ridiculous am I taking it too far I don't know I just hope some of you guys can like do this because I'm looking at videos now you guys are putting out there and it's pretty it's it's pretty fail I'm seeing a lot of offbeat stuff it's not cool Unless, of course, you know, you think it's cool, well, you know, then it's cool to you, but it's not cool to everyone else. You know? You know what I'm saying? Alright, peace. That, that was too much.